stock market has been rising since the election, and after the news of Pfizer's vaccine's 90% effectiveness, the Dow gained over 1,000 points, while certain stay-at-home stocks, they took a dive. Fox 59's Angela Gano sat down with Mike Reeves from Strategic Wealth Designers to discuss how a vaccine could impact the markets. Mike, the vaccine news led to this surge for the stock market. What do you think this means for the economy? Is it time to buy, sell, or just stay put with what you own? Well, the vaccine is huge for the economy. I mean, they're talking about 90% effective. I mean, that's awesome. You know, we're coming out of this dark tunnel, hopefully sometime next year into the light with the vaccine. As far as the market is concerned, you saw a move up in some names that were way down, obviously travel, leisure, and you saw some of those stay-at-home stocks finally come down. You know, what it means for investors, this news or any other news, have a plan and stick to it. That'll help you during times that are good and difficult times. Yeah, let's dive into that. What you're just talking about a little bit deeper, that entertainment, travel, event stocks, saw those big surges to the vaccine news. And then those companies like Zoom and maybe in Netflix, Peloton, um, taking a little bit of a dive. What do you think about that trend? Do you think that's going to continue? Yeah, I mean, nobody knows for sure, but it's natural to have a great rotation is with the difference between value and growth. I mean, it's become a huge gap between value stocks and growth stocks. It's only natural that some money rotates out of one sector into another. And again, like you're saying, we're, we're, we not only saw it yesterday, but you've seen it creep up for a while. And, you know, as far as those cyclical names and some of those big tech, tech names kind of come down for a while. But what the takeaway for an investor would be, rebalance your portfolio. Sometimes if a sector's gone too far, take a little bit out of that side and put it in, in the side that's down. You want to shave it. You want to rebalance it. You want to monitor what's going on. And if you're not comfortable doing that for yourself, use an advisor mm -hmm. and as we inch closer to 2021 how do you see the rest of this year in trending for the stock market well there's still a lot of unknowns out there i mean the new vaccine sure the results have been great there's some concerns about storing it or moving it mm -hmm. extremely low temperatures need to be available for that vaccine um you know other reasons for some stock market volatility here so again, it's my crystal balls in the shop. It's kind of hard to, to know exactly what happens, but the key would be having that all seasons approach, have more than stocks and bonds, have other asset classes, have tools that put safety nets under your portfolio, protect yourself. You want to keep that retirement on track. Well, we appreciate you guiding us through it. Thank you so much, Mike. You're welcome. Well, for more information on this topic or any other money saver, you can head to fox59.com and click the Strategic Wealth tab.